We see some cops in Ontario, Canada engaging with a group of bigoted protesters protesting a church-sponsored Halloween drag show event when one pastor said this. So the adults that are in there provocatively dressed around minors, that's not an offense? Ma'am, I don't believe that you've been in there, so I don't think you can attest to what they Well, apparently, according to you, I'm not allowed in there. In which is a public church. In this man, you're protesting on an office. I'm protesting growing adults who want to dress in lingerie and dance around children. We have a whole country, a whole nation filled with children who do not know whether they are boys or girls because of activities like this. And it is up to us adults to stand up and to protect these children. To stand on their side in front of them is morally wrong. It is wrong. And for them to hold it in a church is wrong. Nobody's blocking. Look at the entrance is wide open. Nobody's blocking the entrance. You guys should be outraged for what's going on right now. You should be outraged. Ma'am, ma'am, you're making assumptions. Are you, there? you just stated that you don't know what's going on in there. I know exactly what's going on in there. You have seven drag queens in there that are around children. Seven drag queens that are around children. Carving pumpkins, having drag story time. And it is quite amazing pumpkin carving and story time for children at a community gathering place. Not only is it surprising in itself that a church would hold such an event, but it's also really beautiful and constructive to see a religious institution recognize the humanity of the drag performers and by extension, the LGBTQ plus community as a whole. So guys, I've been posting since yesterday, I'm in Gravenhurst protesting these sick adults and now we have these two officers that are saying that we are a problem somehow the whole five of us are a big problem not the pedophiles inside that building yes you all are the problem not the people inside yeah. protecting child predators you're supposed to protect the children not feed them to the sick and mentally disabled feeding children to child predators saying they're doing their jobs. Look at them shaking hands. Yeah, wear the badge with honor, real honor, disgrace. The disgusting person behind the camera is Crystal Peters. And she was eventually arrested for failing to change her behavior after being warned multiple times by the cops to tone down her rhetoric and keep things peaceful with this per local media. Brace Bridge OPP arrested protester Peters Saturday afternoon for causing a disturbance outside Trinity United Church in downtown Gravenhurst. It was hurtful and upsetting to have words of raw hate yelled loudly and incessantly at anyone who came near the church prior to the show, said Bonnie Dart, chair of Gravenhurst Against Poverty. The show was family appropriate with young children and some parents dressed in their Halloween costumes, decorating pumpkins, dancing to kid pop songs and receiving Halloween treats. They were five drag queens dressed in Halloween themed costumes, dancing to Halloween themed songs. The event was hosted by Muskoka Pride and two boxes of food and $70 were donated to Gravenhurst Against Poverty.